that launched a thousand clicks. No, that's not good. I still like the mystery behind the behind. I know, nobody likes puns anymore. Oh, it's like that? I'm doing all the work now? Sorry, I'm sorry, MJ. I'm just, uh, I'm just dreading this interview. Look, I know you won't win the Pulitzer, but Golden Goddess is a hot story. It's what the people want. Is it though? Oh, no. I know what you're doing, and I want you to stop doing it right this minute. What am I doing? You're thinking about your little sorority sister. News flash, college is over. <laughs> this is the real world. Vanessa's a big girl. She knows Mark is a cheap man. I'm not sure if she even cares. I know. Oh, okay. Golden Goddess is on her way up. When she walks in here, you're gonna put your big girl thong on and be a pro, right? Right? Right. Pinky swear. <laughs> People don't still do that. Why wouldn't they? It's the best kind of swear. Now give me your pinky. Oh, come on with the ass. We need to talk. Alone. And I'm not a Oh, girl. Girl. <sighs> Welcome. Look, the Golden Goddess thing was just another way to increase my visibility. So you're using this mystery man to get followers? For the record, Marcus King approached me. So it was Marcus King? Yes. You do know that he has a wife, right? Do you think she deserves having this go viral? <laughs> Did you think about that with Jebediah Hawthorne? I looked you up. Reverend Jebediah Hawthorne was a hypocrite. <laughs> so is Marcus King. You're not better than me. I never said I was. But you think you are. So what if I do? You think you're smarter and you got all your shit together. I bet you got a nice little man tucked away somewhere. But it's not real. <laughs> you think it is. But it's not. Oh, that should be your next story. Wives and girlfriends out here running around like that got the perfect relationship when their man out there dipping and telling other women they gotta sleep with them to get a job. Grabbing and shouting at them on the street. They know who they are and what they do. We've been scooped. What? Not scooped. I didn't say anything to anybody. And I know you didn't, right? I told Vanessa because I didn't want her to be blindsided. So she went out and found herself a fall. You know Boji has a diet book coming out in two weeks. I'm sure he jumped all over this. It's definitely Photoshop. And not a good one either. You see how the crease in the crack don't really match? You know how you always got the, got the V over the cheeks? You know what I mean? Like I said, right above your cheeks. Okay, I got it. Maybe I was just trying to make you laugh. You know what? I'm not. It is what it is. That's your best profile. Thank you. You're gonna look incredible, sweetie. I just, I cannot even believe I'm here. Bill De Silva asks for a favor. I don't say no. I don't get it, he's not even my manager. Well, yet, but uh, he's pulling out all the stops for you. So you must have something. Feel the sun on your skin. You're on the beach, it's beautiful. We need, we need more wind. That's clearly a windy day, okay? Turn it up, turn it up, yeah. You want to build a film that you pay for photographers soon he'll be paying you to take a picture. You're not going to ask me to take my top off, right? No, of course not. I tried to tell her you wasn't here, but this is crazy. Oh, uh, this is I've never met a boji in my life. It doesn't matter. What matters is that everyone else thinks you did. What about the real story? My story! That's what you guys were paying for. We need to tell the truth. Uh, we needed an exclusive, boo. Not you. Doesn't matter if it's the truth or not. Do you guys know what's gonna happen to me if the story doesn't blow up? I 
can't even pay my rent. Maybe we can share a Netflix account or something. I'll give you my login. Oh, I gotta take this. Uh, I know the way out. Hello? Hey, Layla, I'm so glad I caught you. Uh, apparently you left the studio without taking care of your bill. What? I can just pop an invoice in the mail to you. But I, I thought Bill took care of that already. This is no, maybe some kind of misunderstanding. What did he say? Listen, I'm sure you two can figure it out. Uh, in the meantime, I just need it paid. Yeah. Go ahead and send that to me. It was wonderful working with you, my dear. Let's do it again soon, okay? Hey, Roxanne. It's Layla. Got any work for me? <laughs>